Hi everybody, this is Beach Cricket, and I'm at a new camp, because every 14 days when you're um, going on BLM to camp on, you've got to move. So here we are, I think you can kind of see, there's Jack over there, <laughs> and um, we have Shuttle Babe right there, you can't see everybody, but anyway, look what I'm doing right now. I, you see the ladder? <laughs> During all these wonderful adventures that I'm having, Shuttle Babe gets dirty, so I'm trying to clean her up. <laughs> There's my ladder there, and um, oof, she has been really dirty. So let me show you around. I got the back looking really good. Oh, this was just coated with dirt really bad. So, you can see the stickers and decals really well, so nice. And um, over here, I've got three of them clean, three of the windows and part of the body. You can see that I have really gotten into some mud, <laughs> and it's all over. The windows were all like this, just really coated with all kinds of dirt. So I've got two more to do on this side, and then I've got the driver's side in the front of Shuttle Babe to clean up. And then it'll be looking pretty sporty because, whew, we've had a lot of fun, but everywhere we go, it's usually BLM, so it's dirty. You know, it's dusty, off the grid, you know, places that your rig can really get dirty. So she's overdue on that. And here's Mike's setup right here. We've got Ken over here. Ken's got a nice box truck. And um, he's got it all set up pretty nice in there. It really is comfortable. And then right there, he is drying out some, some kind of vegetables. I'm not sure which one he's doing. But that's his rig. And he also carries, pulls that tr cargo trailer over there, this one. And then also he has this caravan trailer that he is selling. So let me get you the phone number on that. So if anybody is interested, you can get this wonderful cargo trailer. It's really, it's a gypsy trailer. It's really nice. I also um, put my lighter wind cell up here and um, got my lights and everything set up so I have a little cozy little nook over here and of course little lights. This is our kitchen and this a lot of times is where we uh, kind of hang out right here under mics. And then Tata Trippin, she has that van over there and she's got that really cool kind of shade. Let me show you that too. Now Tata Trippin, she has a really nice van and she's got a wonderful setup too. She has her little patio area here and then she has this canopy to have extra shade and you can also, there are poles that lift this side over here up if you want it way up. So it's really nice. I like her little setup here. Very, very good. All right, let's go over here to that gypsy trailer. A little caravan trailer. Now, Ken is really very handy with his hands. And um, he did a really good job on this. So, if anybody's interested in this, you can give him a call. So I think this is like a little inside counter. It says, I'm not really sure. I haven't um, really looked at everything. And it's uh, not finished on the inside. So you can add your own touch to it. But it's very nice. He's got the lights on there. good job on this. Little wheel covers. Nice strong 
hitch there. Yeah. So if you're interested in a cargo trailer of a unique design, give Ken a call. Now over here, Jack is. Got his setup over here. I like this uh, area really nice because of uh, you can you got the forest out there, but you got grass. <laughs> it does have rocks, but you don't have as much dusty grass uh, is holding all of this in, so you don't have dusty dirt blowing all over you. Well, this is Jack set up. And he's got his hammock up. And you can buy these at Walmart with the screen on it. I think he said it was around $40 for this hammock. But this is his home. He's got his gravity chair out here. And that's his rig. So it all looks really nice how he's got it done so we all have our little spots and uh we gathered some wood we have cardboard and everything for fire starter and um we haven't had a fire yet we just uh settled in this is our third day and we're just getting used to it and enjoying it it's really nice just going to give you an angle on <laughs> on this side. A lot of times I put my little pet fence here so I can um, put lights on it or sometimes just barricade a little spot where I don't want the girls to run out of. So that's why I have that there. Sometimes I wash clothes and I hang them up on there. <laughs> Those pet uh, folding little gates are wonderful. I think I'll take the girls out for a little stroll. And there's a really cool bus over there. And um, it's just really nice. It's an older one. And it looks really homey. Alright, let's go on our walk. Roxy, are you ready to go for a walk? Huh? Where are you going for a walk? How about you, Riley? Let's do it, girls. Let's go for a walk. Come on. Let's go this way. This looks like fun. Let's go explore. And we have the beautiful mountains in the background here, so that makes it really nice too. I always love that. Now this cat is elk, and we got woke up the very first night, and um, it was a weird sound. It almost sounded like a coyote, but it sounded weirder and Jack got out there and looked and it was a whole herd of elk. Ooh, I wish I had got that on video instead of this. So this is what the camp looks like from where I'm at in the forest. Pretty cool, huh? Okay, Riley, be careful of that. Those right there, that cactus. You too, Roxy. Yeah, be careful of the cactus. You should be pretty much uh, used to looking out for those by now. There's a few out here. Yeah. They are pretty, though. Pretty prickly pear. They're starting to have some blooms. Riley's under here, underneath the tree. Just sniffing around at things, and so is Roxy. You smell anything, you guys? Yeah. So that's why I love being out here. Uh, I just sometimes need to get away from the camp and just reflect on life, enjoy my pups and nature, just enjoy the fresh breezes, the beauty of nature, everything about it. That's why I like this. And I like sharing it with you. All right, more to come. Beauty in nature.
Well, that was fun. I enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun getting out there and exercising and seeing nature. Always love that. Anyway, Nomad Life rocks. And wake up and live, people. There you go. So, with that, I'm going to let you guys go. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And Beach Cricket out. Bye, everybody.